It certainly is. It looks a little better through this weekend, Darren, but not an awful lot better. And we still have uh, three severe flood warnings in the northeast of Scotland. Flood line numbers 08459 And it's hardly surprising. Just look at the amount of rain we've had over the last couple of months. Take Aberdeen, for instance, extremely wet. 147 millimetres of rain so far this month, twice what we'd expect. And that's on the back of the wettest October ever recorded in Aberdeen. Now, the wet weather that we had yesterday and the thick cloud has swept its way northwards. It's cleared the mainland of Scotland, just hanging on in the Northern Isles. And we've seen clusters of cloud following on behind, particularly across England and Wales. And that cloud is producing some really quite heavy downpours of rain. Pretty miserable weather across parts of England and Wales. For the next few hours at least, some of the uh, heavier downpours are going to be across southern England, Wales and the Midlands. Certainly some difficult travelling conditions, some hail, some thunder thrown in for good measure. And a few of those showers just will edge their way a little further north. We've also got some showers, particularly across the eastern side of Northern Ireland, and those showers continuing to pile their way in across the northeast of Scotland. The wind's going to be blustery to add to all that, so it'll take up the edge off the temperatures. 11 or 12 degrees at the very best. Now this is the weather front that's hanging on across the north of Scotland, still bringing some rain here. Low pressure is with us though and swinging around it we have bands of cloud, bands of showers, a little bit quieter possibly as we move into Sunday and then a development taking place around the Pyrenees is going to bring us some more wet weather from the south as we move into the beginning of next week. So we're going to keep a few showers overnight, they're going to be reluctant to die away, and so as a result, temperatures of 5 or 6 degrees. Takes us into the weekend, and tomorrow very similar to what we've seen today. Some sunshine to begin with, but uh, showery rain gathering you here in the southwest, heavy at times, and pushing its way steadily northwards across England and Wales. Sunshine and showers elsewhere, and still quite windy as well. And those temperatures, well, really very similar to what we're seeing during today. Now, as we move our way into Sunday, the showery rain that we've got in the south is going to be uh, settling in across the north of Scotland. And then it's a little bit quieter. The wind's not quite so strong. We're going to keep a few showers, mainly around western and southern coastal areas. There's a chance that across central and eastern parts, it may even stay dry with a little bit of uh, sunshine. As we move our way into the beginning of next week, finally, it's going to turn wetter once again. Some rain pushing up from the south. The wind's picking up as well. Quieter further north with some sunshine and just one or two showers. From one Darren, it's back to the other Darren.